Hi, my name is Dave Andrews. Today I'm going to show you how to burn files to a DVD. Let's go to our computer and I have here a blank DVD that I'm going to insert into my DVD drive. Now uh, you have to have a DVD writer drive for this, so make sure that you have a DVD RW type of drive. So I've got that inserted and the computer is going to recognize that I've just inserted a blank CD. It's going to pop up a window that asks me what I'd like to do with that blank CD. There it is there. It's going to ask me what I want to do. I'm going to click on Burn Files to Disk using Windows. Now it's going to ask me what I'd like to name my disk. I'm going to call this My Data DVD. Click Next. Now what it's doing now is it's actually formatting that DVD uh, so that once it is completed formatting, I'll be able to copy files to it just like I would a normal hard drive. This could take some time. A DVD can hold a lot of data, uh, so formatting that space uh, may take a little bit of time. Right, but it's actually done. Uh, it was actually pretty quick. So what this did was this opened up an Explorer window. Uh, that showed basically uh, like we're used to seeing where we can drag files into an area to write to it. I'm going to open up my documents. I'm going to pull out a couple files here. A minute, get to make this smaller here. I'm just going to gra grab some of these files. I'm going to drag them over into my DVD window and drop them. It's copying 10 items to that DVD. Twenty items. Now I'm going to eject my DVD. And when I click the eject button, it's actually closing the session on the disk. Now what that allows me to do is to take the DVD put it into other computers and because that burn session has been closed those other computers will be able to uh, read the data. So now that burn has completed I'm just going to open this up, pull out my DVD and the files that I've written can now be transferred to another computer using this DVD. My name is Dave Andrews and I've just showed you how to burn files to a DVD.